Master Shift. The Positive News Network. This just in. There's been a mass pandemic of positivity, which has led to some sort of world peace. Now, as we know, the only way to reach world peace is by billions of people shifting their mindsets to a more positive one. And now it appears that's happened, as reports are pouring in that people around the globe are peacefully coexisting. This positivity outbreak has spread to all seven continents, and the world's leaders are perplexed as to how peace was achieved without their involvement. Well, obviously, the power is always with the people. Speaking of which, let's go to Siobhan, who's hit the streets to get some reactions. Siobhan? Thanks, Brian. I'm here today on the streets to find out what people are thinking regarding this worldwide peace pandemic. So in light of this announcement, how are you feeling and what's it been like for you? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> For you, and what do you think about this? <laughs> what does that look like for you and your personal life? Like, what does world peace look like? Well, we would always be peaceful here. <laughs> this is like a nice piece of like apple pie. Amazing! <laughs> I'm in shock. Well, I'm really overjoyed. I've been waiting 40 years for this to happen. Having the experience of love, feeling connected with everybody. That lady over there too. I feel like I know this. We want to get his take on this announcement about world peace. Scruffy, it's going pretty good for you, huh? Wonderful. I realized my whole life I was sleeping. Everything else we do seems to be contagious, so I don't see why there's an exception for that. And that's so great for the board. I think it's been a long time coming. Yeah, I guess we're going to have a big party tonight. I guess we'll start over. Uh, yeah, I think there must be some ulterior motive on this. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm probably going to have like dinner or something to celebrate. For a few streets!